Hello, welcome to a new tutorial of Acrocomputer Berlin, the EN ModMyMachine.com, especially for you. I've been to the hairdresser yesterday, um, but I think I have to shave again sometime. Um, today I'm going to show you how to mount uh, AquaGratix water cooling block on a HD 4850 from um, ATI. Um, nothing special, in fact, another graphic card cooler, but anyway, every card has some specialties so I'm gonna show you this time on a 4850 have fun with it you need the graphic card cooler, the card itself the screws supplied with the cooler, uh, turn paste and screwdrivers first step is to take off all the screws around the GPU, the RAM and, of course, the voltage regulators. Next step, take off the fan connector and dismount the graphic card cooler. Take off all the pads and put them on the stock cooler. Clean up the GPU and take off the stock paste. This is something we can run from. This is the now you can put thermal paste on the RAM blocks, on the GPU, on the four big voltage regulator blocks, and on the small eight voltage regulator blocks. So you've been Now you can mount the water cooling block. Um, best way to mount it is to orientate um, on the space for the GPU. Next step, tighten the screws around the GPU and then all the other screws. So, this was another tutorial with Aqua Computer Berlin, the EMModMyMachine.com. Um, I showed you how to mount a graphic card cooler on an HD 4850. All my video tutorials will be available in my shop soon as a DVD. Um, so, you can pick any um, video tutorial you want to have um, for a fair price of um, one euro per uh, video, I think. And um, if you just want to mail more detail or you want to play it on your DVD if internet is not working. So be welcome and see you soon on my next tutorials. Bye.